Hello, everybody. This is going to be a pretty short video, but it will be educational. I put out a tweet asking what common things people mess up and what they need advice on. I got a bunch of great responses. None of that matters, because I had a dream last night. And I went to the lab, I tested, and it turned out to be true. I'm having a breakthrough, and I want to share this with you guys. So... I even have a video entitled why or yeah, why you shouldn't auto cancel back air, but I've figured out a way to optimize it that I think some people already do naturally. This will help some of you. Some of you might already be doing this. Okay. But here in this playback slot, I have how I normally do auto cancel back air. You've seen mango bait people with like fading in and then fading out at the last second, right? And I've always tried to do that. I, I do the back air and I slam my stick back the other way. And for some reason, it just doesn't work. And I'm thinking, he must be slamming his stick even faster. This is just insane. But in my dream, I had figured it out, and it turned out to be true. So in slot one, I have how I usually do the back here. Let's just look at it real quick. So as you see, this is Falco fading away frame perfectly. He's trying to get away as fast as possible. And this is a reasonable spacing, if you can kind of see behind the menu. This is a reasonable spacing to try and do this bait. At least from what I've seen when people do it successfully. I've never done it. But it just doesn't work with my method. Now the important thing to note here is the type of jump that you do. What I always do, especially because sometimes I use A to back air, it depends on which direction I'm facing, but now I'm gonna fix that for sure. I'm back flipping. So I back flip towards somebody and the way I think this works is that you have a lot of backwards momentum as you do this backflip jump. But if you do uh, just a neutral jump where you jump up with no backflip, you have tons of time. I'll just show you in this in this second slot. This is me drifting away frame perfectly. So this is the same input, except I'm not backflipping. This is the same back air timing and drift away timing. And I'm not even close. I have a couple other examples here. I think this, yeah, this is... Um, it's a frame perfect back air instead of one frame delayed. I'm pretty sure these next ones. Yeah, so this is me drifting in for various amounts of time, which is just crazy. So here I'm drifting in for like five or six frames or something. And this one's even more extreme where I drift in for an even longer period of time. Again, no backflip. And you see Falco kind of goes one way and then starts coming back the other way. And just to contrast this with frame perfectly trying to drift away this backflip back air. It's just not even close to working. And Sheik doesn't even have the biggest shield grab at the game. We gotta stop backflipping. This must be, Mango must have been doing this forever. I'm probably gonna go back in VODs and watch, but I wanted to share this with you guys. Uh, maybe post in the comments if, if this is helpful to you. Maybe you guys have been doing this before. I, I don't know, is this only new to me? Let me know. Um, Thanks for watching. I'll come back and I will address those Twitter comments and make more educational content. But thanks for watching and uh, let me know what you think. Okay, peace.